welcome to Young Chef India Schools, a culinary contest that will test the skills of the best aspiring young chefs from all over the country. A grueling competition that brings together the top 10 young school chefs from seven cities, Delhi, Jaipur, Hyderabad, Ahmedabad, Bangalore, Pune and Kolkata. And they are about to battle it out for one coveted title. Young Chef India Schools is hosted by IIHM, an institute of hotel management of international repute. Established in 1994, it is the leading school chain that trains students to become professionals in the sector of hospitality and hotel management. We conceived the idea of a contest to select the best young school chef from the country. Looking at the immense potential food and hospitality sector offers as a career to the students today, while there are numerous contests that are geared towards discovering potential talents in this field, Young Chef India School is a culinary contest with a difference in that, along with the judges, the audience gets to vote and choose the winner. Young Chef India Schools, uh, uh, which is being very successful, it was conceptualized and now been successfully running for the last six years uh, by IIHM, uh, has been such a fabulous initiative. Uh, uh, catching, catching this young talent when they are young, uh, they are not sure what they want uh, going forward. They are in the 12th standard. Uh, they are looking for something uh, different, something unique. Uh, they are driven by a passion. Uh, this gives them an opportunity to get a real-time feel of what it is like to be a chef, of what it is like to be put under that pressure cooker and uh, uh, be asked to deliver. The 10 contestants featured today are the best amongst hundreds of students fighting for a berth in the finals. And they are from none other than the national capital region including Delhi. A city known for its king-size appetite and diverse food choices. And the top 10 contestants who have arrived at IIHM's Badarpur Delhi campus today for the cook-off are Swarnima Podar from Kundan Vidya Mandir, Navya Shali Chauhan from Wellam Girls School, Niyati Sharma from National Victor School, Mansi Saini from Salwan Public School, Sukriti Bajaj from Summerwill School, Navedita Vinay Shah from Indirapuram Public School, Ishita Sattu from DLF Public School, Asta Mathur from Ryan International School, Shashwat Vora from DAV Public School, Karanveer Singh from Springdale Senior School. My advice to these 10 contestants uh, will be that I think if you give your best, uh, take it easy. Uh, in any way, I think uh, they are the winners in, all the in, in any way that you call because making it to the top 10 is not easy. You know, where thousands of students apply and um, there's a very, very stiff competition. I think it's not about winning or losing, it's about participation. It's about, it's about uh, giving it a try and that's where the dreams are built from. As the people on ground from IIHM put finishing touches to the setup, let's meet the contestants. Hey guys, I'm Karan Veer Singh from Springdale Senior School, Amritsar. My father is a bakery chef. My grandma is taking cooking classes since 73. So, I am already a young chef in my house. So, uh, I want to prove the world that I am the young chef of India now. Hi guys, I'm Swarnima. I'm from Kundan Vidya Mandir School, Ludhiana. My whole family is a foodie and I am blessed with having amazing parents. Everywhere we travel, we eat at places like fine dine restaurants to street thelas and everything. So it came from there. When I was really young, I cooked like this very bad sandwich for my mom's birthday when I was a kid. That's when it started and it's been going on so, since so long and my family is amazing. You know, they get me recipe books and ingredients and they especially take me to food markets and whatnot. Hi guys, I'm Astha from Ryan International School, Faridabad. IHM is a big name in hospitality and it has conducted this contest, Young Chef India. And I'm really excited, I'm tense. And I'm happy and let's see what happens. Hi, I'm Navya Shali Chauhan from Valum Girls School, Dehradun. I got to know about this competition from my teachers. 
at school and they told me you know you should take part in this competition because I've been cooking for two three years now. First when I came here for the first round I wasn't really prepared for it but then I qualified and the judges liked my food so here I am for the city finals and wish me all the best. Hello everyone, I am Nivedita Shah from Indrapuram Public School. I love to cook and I also love to travel and this platform is giving me both these opportunities. I think I've got the potential and I'm full of energy to win this competition. You give me potatoes, you give me paneer, you give me chicken. I'll make the best out of it. Hello guys, it's Neerti. I'm from National Victor Public School, Parpal Guns, Delhi. I tried this competition last time also. I didn't get selected but that was not the ending. I tried it this year also and I got selected. I was expecting that I'll get selected because last year I was not so prepared and this year I was well prepared because I want to have it and I achieved it. So uh, this year I don't uh, know who will win today but all what matters is participation and I have uh, to give my best shot today. Hi, my name is Shashwat Vora and I'm from DAV Public School, Amritsar. I'm here for the Delhi City Finals, organized by the IIHM group. And when I got a call, I was really happy, but now when I'm here, I'm a little nervous seeing those eight girls and only two boys. But my cooking will show that uh, men can cook and men can cook better than girls. And uh, I'll be cooking fish, which will be defining the taste of my city. And I hope judges like my dish. Hello, I'm Mansi from Salwan Public School, Gurgaon. Apart from uh, giving me new opportunities and new challenges, uh, Young Chef India has also given me a stage where I can prove myself, uh, my talent. Uh, also, it's my hobby. Cooking is my hobby, and uh, and I, I made new friends when I uh, when I came here. I got selected in top ten. So, fingers crossed. Hello, my name is Sukriti Bajaj. I am from Somerville School, Vasundra Enclave, Delhi. I've been through uh, the other nine city finalists and I think that I have that in me and I believe in myself that I'll be able to make it after seeing their potential and I'm not actually doubting about their potential but I think that I have that courage or thing in me that I could make it. Hi guys, this is Ishita Satu from DLF Public School, Young Shift. It's a great opportunity for the school students uh, to set their career and when I applied I was not expecting me to clear all the rounds but now I'm here with the other nine finalists from all over Delhi. I'm happy, I'm excited and I'm just hoping for the best. As the contestants get ready to face the fire, they get an unmissable opportunity. A crash course on do's and don'ts while cooking. And the men in charge are none other than Chef Shuan, Director, Culinary Arts, Indy Smart Group. And Chef Kak, Director, Food Production and Culinary Arts, IIHM. Hi, good morning. Good morning, good morning sir. sir. How are you today? Good, good. Great, Great, fantastic. Today I'm going to introduce you to a few very basic kitchen basics, really. So you're incredibly blessed to have me discussing this <laughs> just amongst the ten of you. So I think most importantly, jewelry off. Something whenever I walk into a kitchen, I always take my ring off, my watch. Another few very kitchen basics, our chopping board. Vegetables one side, non-veg the other side. Cross-contamination. Knives, you have two knives on your bench. One slightly bigger, one slightly smaller. And then we'll go to some basic cutting, the capsicum. Such a beautiful ingredient, really. So we'll just cut it in half to start off with. I'm just gonna show you a few basic knife skills. So we have julienne, which is a shredding cut. And then we have beautiful small dices that in a French kitchen are called bramoise. So we have three cuts already. Important for you guys, you need to feel comfortable with that knife. You don't have to cut how I cut. I have many years of experience. And then the onion. So two ways to cut an onion, generally, this slicing and chopping. So if we chop an onion, we take, the, we take the outer skin off it. As young chefs, I think you should know all these basics, really. Incredibly important. 
Okay, so I think enough for kitchen basics for one day, really. Is everybody excited? Yes, sir! Okay, so good luck to everybody. Thank you, sir. And let's all have a little group hug before we start, I think. Come, 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 come. Are we still friends? Yeah. And finally, the moment arrives. Time to start the cook-off. Let's meet today's judges. Ten people, five smiles. Why so? Better. Welcome to IIHM Young Chefs India 2016. We are going to be judging you for this competition today. The rules are very simple. This is a mystery basket. You can choose to use all or most of the ingredients from that basket. There's also a common pool of ingredients available for you to use. Besides that, there are three proteins. Chicken, fish, paneer. You have to use any one of those proteins in your dish and make an Indian or Indian-inspired dish with two accompaniments. Out of which one has to be starch. For this, you will get 90 minutes. You will also get additional 10 minutes for picking up your ingredients. Now, let's see who you have to win from us who won our heart and won our heart. Have fun. Your time starts now. Let's cook. Stay tuned to watch the Delhi contestants put their culinary skills to test. The stage is set. The contestants pick up what they need. The cooking begins. What are you doing? It's just fish. The fish is not good, but why? Why? Because you don't want to eat. Until you don't make it, you don't make it good. Yes, sir. Now it's better. Now fish will be good. I am looking forward to the fish. Okay, sir. The humor, the tension, all coming together. What are you cooking? I'm cooking deconstructed paneer makhani with trots okay. and uh, paneer kheer. Okay. So have you made this before? Yes, ma'am. Oh. So your mom taught you or uh, you just... school teacher. Okay. Good. All the best. Thank you, ma'am. Hello, Asta. Hello, sir. What are you doing? Sir, I'm preparing the gravy for this. Okay. Yeah. Good. You're looking very worried. Is everything okay? Yeah, You're everything. Very stressed out. Actually, you know, you know, I'm really tensed. And what is this happening here? Kheer. Kheer? Yeah. Okay. Well done. Keep it up. You're doing a good job. Thank you, sir. All of you have made the kitchen smell beautiful with what you're cooking. You guys are doing a brilliant job. And there's a lot of time. There's 50 more minutes. No need to panic. Boiling, scooping, frying. It's all there. Each contestant is focused to put their very best on the plate. 30 minutes left. Mm. 
This is the time when you need to start cooking your protein. I've been to all your tables and all of you guys are doing an awesome job. Don't panic. Chef Ranbir's encouraging words notwithstanding, the tension is still palpable. Okay, I have three announcements to make. Announcement number one, you guys are super chefs, you've done really well. Announcement number two, there are only 10 minutes left. Announcement number three, you can choose to cook for more than 90 minutes, but we will deduct five points for every five minutes beyond the time extended. Time for final touches. Plating begins. Some are on time and some falling behind. Last one minute. This is the time you don't try anything new, just finish what you have. All right, you have last 15 seconds to complete whatever you're completing. And another five seconds, we'll begin the countdown from 10. So the countdown begins now. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Four, three, two, one. If you are done, please move away from your table. If you're still working, we will be deducting five points. All the food looks good, it smells good. Now we have to find out if it tastes good. And for that, we will wait for you on the tasting table. Good luck. Moment of truth. Let's see what the judges have to say. What have you made, Navya? My main dish is tamatri pahadi murg with cabbage and onion rice and bundi rabri. Nice. The bundi rabri, for me, the beauty of it is you made that bundi yourself. And that, at that age, is beautiful. All the best. Vote for me at youngchefindia.com slash navashali. Good afternoon, chefs. I think uh, at this age, uh, the chicken that you have cooked, uh, it's beautifully cooked, it's tender and juicy, right? And uh, it, it is having the flavor of the gravy that you have, uh, you know, compared it with. So it's nice. Thank you. Please vote for me at youngchefindia.com slash niyati. So I see you've made actually a lot of components. Yes. Were you able to finish on time? Yes, uh, I was actually uh, concentrating that I should, uh, the food should taste better and uh, I should use maximum ingredients which were listed in the basket. Good job. Thank you, Chef. Please do vote for me at youngchefindia.com slash mansi. Everything on the plate is actually inspired from different things. The sauce, the gravy, is like I found a very, very, very old diary of my grandmother which had recipes in it. And the gravy comes from there. Very good effort. Technically, you really inspire us. Good luck. You can take it. Thank you. <laughs> Please vote for me at youngchefindia.com slash Swarnima. not an easy thing to make. A Ras Malai at this age along with that other food. Actually it was very really tough to make it in one and a half hours so I managed everything together. Please vote for me at youngchefindia.com 
sukriti Okay, let's see your buna wok chicken. Yeah. It's a very good dish. For me, uh, the Punjabi flavor are still coming out, minus the ginger. You know, the, the basic tomato and the and the Punjabi spices, which are typical of the erstwhile Punjab, uh, from which karai chicken comes, are coming out. So that's the good part. Please vote for me at youngchefindia.com/nivedita. Presentation, very good. Taste-wise, balance of the sauce, very good. The idea of the tart, very good. Thank you, sir. The makhani gravy with fresh tomatoes, out of the world. Very Thank good. you, sir. Please vote for me at youngchefindia.com slash ishata. What have you made? I've made takatak chicken, paneer parsinda, and jodhpuri bengal. For me, the star is the bengan. I don't know why you're just neglecting the bengan all completely. Like an underrated vegetable, nobody likes it. And the ability to cook a vegetable that nobody likes really well, it's a great gift. Please do vote for me at youngchefindia.com slash asta. One more thing, I must have to, to admit that in work, seeing you work in the kitchen, you were very calm, you were very composed. Um, you were the first one actually to finish. Uh, you were ready with your station, which was absolutely clean and set up. Thank and you, uh, well done. And I think that is the beginning of a good chef and being. So keep that up and, uh, and everything else, else will fall in place. Please guys, vote for me at youngchefindia.com slash Shashwat. And please don't let me down. What have you made, Karvi? I have made flavor azam grilled fish. When you tell me that I have put this spice, this spice, this spice in my sauce, my first reaction is, oh my god, how do you manage it? How do you balance it? The tomatoes took care of that bitterness for you. You can go back to your dad and tell him that you did really well. Thank you, sir. India, vote for me at youngchefindia.com slash karanvi. As these first set of contestants from Delhi NCR go back with mixed verdicts from the judges, remember it is also the viewer who can vote to decide the winner. Watch what Team Jaipur has in store in the next episode. 